From security guards at a Brazilian morgue who stumbled upon a spirit, to a woman in the neighboring bed who was roaring and screeching with a voice reminiscent of the devil. Here are some of the scariest hospital ghost sightings caught on camera. Working in a place filled with dead bodies can be a daunting experience, but when you start witnessing strange occurrences caused by the spirits inhabiting those bodies, it becomes truly mind-blowing. Our research has revealed that spirits can emit different auras, ranging from disturbing to benevolent and gentle. Regardless, encountering a spirit is highly discouraged. However, the security guards at a Brazilian morgue found themselves without any alternative when they stopped <coughs> upon a spirit within the premises. As they made their way down the hallway, the guards were drawn to a specific area due to a peculiar noise emanating from it. Upon reaching the source, they discovered a red door that repeatedly opened and slammed shut, causing the unsettling sound. Strangely, with each step they took towards the door, the intensity of the slamming seemed to double. Undeterred, the guards pressed on until they stood approximately 12 to 15 feet away from the red door, at which point the mysterious slamming abruptly ceased. After a few moments, the lights flickered back to life, prompting the guards to examine the door in order to ascertain what had gone wrong. They soon learned that the door housed the pipes responsible for supplying emergency water to the morgue. While the guards continued their inspection, attempting to identify the issue, they were startled by another loud bang. This time, the noise emanated from a different door on their left. Curious, the guards hurriedly approached and inspected the room beyond only to find nothing that could have caused such a loud disturbance. Perplexed by the entirety of the situation, one guard ventured down the hallway to check if a door was locked, and indeed it was. Given that the door was securely locked and no one was in sight, the question remained who or what was responsible for the relentless slamming of doors and the erratic flickering of lights. Brace yourself for the horrifying ordeal that lies ahead, surpassing the spine-chilling effect of the first clip and leaving you trembling in terror. An old wheelchair covered in rust glides into view as if propelled by an unseen force. Displaying bravery, the YouTuber steps closer to examine it. There are no visible strings or wires attached, leaving the impression that it moved of its own accord. Moving on, the YouTuber ventures outside the building to explore. Along a dimly lit walkway, their attention is drawn to an object up ahead. Keen-eyed viewers might notice a mysterious figure lurking in the darkness. However, as the explorer approaches, the figure mysteriously retreats. Despite searching, the explorer fails to locate the elusive figure. Continuing their investigation, the explorer reaches an area where an old hospital gurney catches their attention. While examining it, the viewers are urged to focus on the back end of the corridor. What could this enigmatic figure possibly be? The YouTuber speculates that it might be the ethereal feet of a doctor without a body. Undeterred, the explorer perseveres and proceeds to another room. Cautiously, they open the door, but moments later, they are visibly startled by something and swiftly turn around, revealing the door closing behind them. At this point, it becomes evident that the explorer has reached their limit, concluding the video. Since its upload to YouTube, viewers have engaged in discussions about the footage and shared their interpretations. Was it a paranormal encounter, or could there be a rational explanation? Notably, the explorer does not appear to have suffered any harm during the night. However, who knows? In January 2015, Jonathan Savoe published a video documenting his visit to his girlfriend in a Paris hospital. According to his account, he encountered a woman in the neighboring bed who was roaring and screeching with a voice reminiscent of the devil. And this is precisely what the video captures.
The footage shows the woman lying flat in her bed, speaking in an eerie and malevolent tone. She relentlessly harasses the couple, hurling insults, labeling them as tacky and ugly, and menacingly predicting their impending demise. Despite the limited visibility of her profile and the absence of visible mouth movement, her chest rising and falling can be observed as she delivers her furious onslaught of insults and threats. At one point, she even mentions calling her mafia acquaintance and threatening to remove her IV drip to facilitate their escape from the hospital. The clip concludes, leaving us to ponder if the woman indeed made an escape attempt. However, Jonathan doesn't leave us in suspense. In his own words, he explains that he stopped recording when the woman, or whatever entity was inhabiting her, began to rise and threaten the life of a person sitting nearby. Five nurses promptly intervened, and Jonathan and his girlfriend were swiftly asked to leave the room. The subsequent events remain unknown to Jonathan. Prior to this experience, he admits to harboring skepticism regarding demonic possessions and related matters, but witnessing it firsthand has converted him into a believer. In August 2016, YouTuber Trevor Heasley shared a clip captured during the filming of Postcards, a student film from 2008 at Pasadena City College. The filming took place at the Metropolitan State Mental Hospital, and Trevor recorded the footage during the shoot. Despite the cast and crew hearing various disturbances during filming, they didn't witness anything out of the ordinary. However, that changed when Trevor reviewed the footage at home. The abandoned state mental hospital appears remarkably eerie in the footage, with darkened windows contrasting the hot summer day. The footage features a mix of close-ups and long shots of the area, including some comedic moments involving the cast. Everyone on set appears to be enjoying themselves, but what occurred next leaves room for speculation. In one particular scene, a ghostly, ethereal figure can be seen walking across the hallway just moments before two cast members rush through, seemingly oblivious to what transpired. While they remain unaware of the presence before their very eyes, it is uncertain if the spirit somehow influenced or even inhabited one of them. Are you ready for the last video? They are even more disturbing than the previous ones, so make sure you're prepared. During an exploration of Overbook Insane Asylum Essex County Hospital in February of 2013, John Edmonds captured an unforgettable sight on camera. Describing the experience, he recalls, I was exploring this massive hospital with my friend when we heard a loud screech and turned to see the scariest four-legged freak. One skeptic named Kerry Morin suggests that the video was filmed in the Verona buildings and that the creature is simply another friend playfully emerging from a doorway on hands and feet. Kerry's perspective may have some merit, but in my opinion, the creature captured in the videos does not bear a human resemblance.